KJ 11 meteorologist Kim Castro. We are starting off the week with an omega block. Low pressure to the west, low pressure to the east, high pressure in the center. It looks like the Greek letter omega, and this is a slow moving system that brings us several rounds of severe weather potential. Starting off with today, a 40% chance for some showers and storms that could be on the strong side. We hike that up to 80% tomorrow. Put it in red. It's a weather impact alert day, and rain chances stay high even through your winter. Wednesday. Let's break down Tuesday severe threat for the afternoon. We're looking at the potential of some damaging wind, some large hail and even an isolated tornado. The hail could be up to two inches in diameter. Wind gusts could be at around 50 miles an hour with some of these strong storms. And there's even a chance for a twister, a higher threat the further north that you go. Here's the breakdown. We could see an isolated cluster of storms that's strong pushing into the city by five, six o'clock today. Day. The model brings in more of that storm potential tomorrow afternoon. That's a snapshot at one o'clock lingering through the late afternoon, taking a break in the evening, more rounds of rain Wednesday morning, potentially more showers behind this in the afternoon. So there's not only a severe threat, but the lingering moisture also brings us a potential for flooding. So look out for high water spots. Look out for some low lying street flooding, and we could even see some isolated flash flood threats, though that's going to be higher to the north and east. Keep up with the forecast this week, at least through Wednesday. Things look better after that.